Hi, uh, I'm Chris Greiner, co-founder of 3S Artspace. So uh, right now we're standing in a, uh, as you can see, what's a really, uh, really raw space. This was actually a food manufacturing facility. Um, but our plan is to turn uh, most of this room that you see here into a 375 capacity flexible performance space um, where we can do everything from a rock show to uh, hosting a winter farmer's market, a sample sale for regional designers. Um, we can do uh, corporate, corporate events, conferences, lecture series, films, uh, dances, you know, it really as much as we can jam into the space, um, we really, we really want to do that. So flat floor, no fixed seating. Um, and, uh, and so you can imagine the stage over there um, and a uh, small bar back here where we'll definitely be uh, serving, <laughs> serving smutty notes. Um, and, uh, and then uh, what's well, hard to tell is there's actually some more space beyond that wall there. Um, and that's all going to be a, uh, a 2,000 square foot art gallery. And then um, beyond the wall here to our left, is uh, um, the back of house area for what will be a farm to table restaurant on the other side of that, which is now currently the uh, shipping and receiving area for, uh, for the space. Um, so yeah, that kind of encompasses the, the, the core 3S mission. And as it turns out, we moved into this great facility, 18,000 square feet, 10,000 on the first floor covers pretty much everything that we want to do as a nonprofit, um, but we were we were given this great gift of 8,000 square feet upstairs, and, um, and the plan is to well, I shouldn't even say the plan because we've already started doing it. Um, we're bringing artists and creative businesses in right now to uh, to start to transform the space. We have 15 units up there right now, and um, and have more than half of those units filled people up there working. Um, it's really great space to get the space activated and uh, start to build the community that we know will form around 3S once we're up and once we're up and running. We're obviously thrilled um, to have been one of one of the nonprofits uh, chosen by both the, the management and the staff of the brewery um, to receive some of the proceeds from the Kate the Great event. Um, and uh, and for, for our part, um, that money is going directly into our capital campaign um, and gonna go directly into the planning and, and, and construction costs for renovating this, this space. Um, we've got a we've got a big nut to raise, but every uh, every five thousand dollars counts. So it's a uh, it's a really really meaningful uh, really meaningful gift to us, and um, and you know meaningful on a number of levels because you know it's it's a uh, it's a show of 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 the the brewery's uh, you know management's commitment to uh, to the local community here, which I, I've witnessed for um, ever since I've been here for you know 10 11 years now um, but also the you know the way that the, that the breweries engage their staff and also um, we love that 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 the staff is you know knows about what we're doing and is excited about it as well so it's a good uh, it's a good way for you know the, the projects to uh, to to um, to kind of come full circle and for us to see support out there in the community for the project is, is really exciting.